Hey, Burns, how you doing today? Welcome to the live. You're number one. You got your spot back. <laughs> Glad to see you today. I'm sharing it out right now. I'll be right back. Okay. Yes, you are. You got it back. So what's going on? Anything new in your life? I got some good Christmas uh, trivia questions. They are good, good, good. Can't wait till they get in so we can start. Some people get here, rather. LSP, her last day at work. She's going to be on vacation. Yeah, Vern beat you. She got you today. Hey, Kingdom Boy, how you doing? Hello. Welcome to the live again. LSP, hey, Mama, and Vern's junk closet. Yes. How's Kingdom Boy doing? And Unlucky Panda? Oh! Hello, hello. Burns, welcome to the live. Please. Thank you, Burns. You on point. The balls have there. Gosh, I went to sleep and did not wake up on time yesterday, Lord. <laughs> I understand. You were tired, boss. You've been doing a lot. You were tired. That's perfectly fine. We have Christmas trivia today, and there's some good questions. I have about 26. I don't I probably won't get through them all, but we'll we'll have fun. I got plenty, so I would have enough. Kingdom Boy, Midtown, Manhattan, New York is where I like. I forgot to tell where I live. Yeah. I forgot to tell you. Okay, Kingdom Boy. You doing good. I want to hear you sing. Um Burn is telling boss hello and welcome to the live. Give a thumbs up. Y'all are speaking. Share it out, please. Share it out. I would appreciate it. Share it out. Yeah, you still working. You don't have much longer, LSP. You're going to be free until the new year. My band is done with the Christmas album. Oh, good. I wish there was a way you could... Uh, Send us a piece of your music or play it for us. But maybe one day we'll get to hear you. We'll get to hear the kingdom boy. <laughs> so how is everybody doing? It's five people in the live and four thumbs up. Now it's six and four thumbs up. Uh, Midtown, Manhattan, New York City. It's, yeah, I read that one. Okay. Panda, how you been doing? Didn't I see Panda? Yeah, unlucky Panda. Yo. <laughs> Yo. Uh, Mike the Ranger, welcome to the live. I'm glad you came in today. Hi, all. Sorry, I've been missing in action. I was in a big rig X. Oh, hit and run Wednesday. New York Brothers. Brother's mother-in-law passed, and then a dear friend passed away. Please keep me in your prayers. I will, sweetheart. You've been through a lot this week, and I'm still running your playlist, Mike. For some reason, my, um, what is it? My little pad, whatever you call it. It keeps stopping on me. It's old, for one thing. That's probably why. But I should be done this evening. And I'll send you a message. I'll send the video when I'm done. Kingdom Boy, good. The band is called Neon, and we're on Spotify and uh, SoundCloud right now. I'm going to check it out on Spotify then. Okay. The boss is speaking to Mike the Rank. Mike, I'm sorry. To hear. How are you doing? Did you get hurt? Did you get injured in that wreck? And it was a hit and run? Oh, my goodness. Bless your heart. 
Well, we're going to pray for you. And uh, sorry, you have my condolence about the death in your family and your friend. I will most definitely keep you in my thoughts and prayers. Kingdom Boy, my first friend from pre preschool died. He was diagnosed with um, HIV. Oh, sorry to hear that. You you have my condolence also. Louis Fuller, how, how are you doing today, Flower? I am blessed and highly favored. I am doing good. How are you doing? Mike the Ranger, uh, Bruce, Bruce Ribs, uh, Soren Neck, and Stiff Back. Okay. I'm, I'm just glad nothing was broken. Nothing was broken. That's a blessing. But bruises, I think a bruise sometimes hurt worse than broken, though. AKA Jane 615. Welcome to the live. He says, hi, everybody to in the live. Kingdom Boy, you should. You should. My band is Christmas album is upbeat. That sounds good. Okay. Mike says, keep going. Lucifer ain't taking me out without a fight. That's right. That's right. You stand your ground and you fight. I almost said something bad. <laughs> but you fight. Okay. Louis Fuller, me too. I'm doing great today. God bless you and everyone in YouTube community. That's right. Uh, Mike, you need some CBD pain roll on. You sure do, Mike. For the, hey, 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 Mike. For them aches and pains and them bruises, I wish you was near me, baby. I'd be rubbing it all over your body because this is what you need. I put stuff in this little bag and I can't find it. This right here. This is what you need, Mike. It's roll on. I put some on today on my knee. Arthur was coming, you know, is trying to infiltrate my knee again. But this is what second time I've used it this week. Because when I put it on, it generally lasts a couple of days. And this is CTFO. And this is for uh, muscle and joint relief. And it really works, Mike. Uh, let's see. Kingdom Boy, but college, I'm going for the music and acting class because I want my band to continue when we're grown up, too. That'll be good. That's good. That's good. Okay, y'all ready to start the trivia questions? Well, uh, I want to let everybody know before we start, too. How are you going? Oh, you speaking tomorrow. Um, today at four after my live, kicking it with Karen, we'll be going live. So when we leave my live, we'll go to kicking it with Karen. She's going live. Marley, there's a tooting girl. Hey, everyone. How you doing today, Marley? Uh, you heard what she said, Mike. You will rub it all over your body. You go fly. <laughs> I forgot how you and Mike talk. You and Mike the Ranger, y'all just show out when y'all talking. But Mike, my link will come up on, on the uh, night boat. I have my link. If you want to order you some to rub on, baby, it's, 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 it's this is the bomb.com right here. You better get your little, little taste of it, Mike. Uh, playlists are being completed and we'll be there tomorrow. I just know or to go for my prayer warrior brothers. That's good, Mike. That, that's right. That's right. You got it right, Mike. Welcome to the live from Burns Kingdom Boy. But the band is 17 and 18 and 19 years old. Y'all babies. Y'all babies. But that's good. Y'all doing something positive. Molly, good. I'm eating my pasta, hubby. We'll be off in an hour until January the 2nd. So excited. Yes. When y'all going to North Carolina? Burns says, I did catch that, Marley. <laughs> Life with Bob and Boo Boo. Hi, Bob. Welcome to the live. Glad you came back today. Mike the Ranger. Mike, you see what she putting in there? Mike the Ranger, Flower Glamour, CTFO link is, get rid of that pain you got, Mike. We want it gone. Be gone. Pain be gone. Be gone. Uh, to the six in the chat, 
Thank you for being here. Thank you, Vern. The boss, hi there. Life with Bob and Boo Boo. And welcome. Thumbs up. That's right. Thumbs up the live. Thumbs up the live. Hey, boss. Thank you. Okay. For our first trivia question. Are y'all ready? Ready, set, go. Which popular crisp Christmas beverage is also called milk punch? Which popular Christmas beverage is also called milk punch? What is your ideas? Burn, slab with Bobby Boo Boo, welcome. Thank you, Mike. The Ranger, the Boss Life online, much love. Going to take it easy and catch you all later. Much love, all. Much love to you. Kingdom Boy, eggnog. That's the answer, Kingdom Boy. Everybody's knowing it. Uh, Life with Bob and Boo Boo, eggnog. But Kingdom Boy got it first. He said eggnog. And Burns said eggnog. Marley, eggnog. The boss says, okay, Mike. Lewis Fuller, eggnog. That's it. Which popular Christmas beverage is also called milk punch? And that's eggnog. Now, a lot of these questions, I didn't know the answers until today myself. I learned a lot in these questions. And I didn't know that about milk, milk punch being eggnog. Okay, number two. What did the other reindeer what did the other reindeer not let Rudolph do because of his shiny red nose? What did the other reindeers not let Rudolph do because of his shiny red nose? Go Vern's, go Vern's, that's it. Join in any reindeer games. That's it. The other other ones would not let them join in any other. Lewis eggnog is a is an awesome for Christmas party. It is. I love eggnog. Play games. Lewis play in the reindeer games. The balls. Everybody know that. LSP P play reindeer games. Uh, Life with Bob join any reindeer games. Hey, Mama Ray Ray, welcome to the live. We're doing Christmas trivia today, and uh, we got some good questions going. Mama Ray Ray saying hello to everybody in the live. Okay, the next question. How many ghosts showed up in A Christmas, Christmas Carol? How many ghosts showed up in A Christmas Carol? How many ghosts? Burn, burns. Are you reading my paper? <laughs> That's good. You got it. Life with Bob said four. Bozo, I've been missing you. Who would have ever thought I would miss the Bozo? I haven't seen you this week. I missed you so much, Bozo. I'm glad you're here. Uh, Bozo. Uh, hey, I'm the reindeer chew book. Is here. <laughs> See that? That's why I needed you here. Boss said three. It was four, boss. LSP said three. Marley's telling her brother in Tootland, hello. LSP, hey, Bozo. Okay, it was four. Okay. Now, everybody in the live should get this one. Where was Jesus Christ born? Where was Jesus Christ born? Bozo said on Christmas, June bug is Mr. Scrooge. <laughs> LOL, I know that. Uh, Mama Ray Ray, is she speaking to everybody? Burns, Bethlehem, Marley, Bethlehem. That's right. I knew what you meant, Burns, when you put it the first time. Life with Bob, Bethlehem. The boss, Bethlehem. Bozo, you see how she skipped over me. I did not skip over you. I read on Christmas, June book is Mr. Scrooge, L-O-L. See, you were too busy trying to get your toots out and you didn't hear it. But everybody's right. Bethlehem. 
Okay, the next one. The movie Miracle on 34th Street is based on a real life department store. What is the name of this store? And everybody should get this one. The movie Miracle on 34th Street is based on a real life department store. What is the name of this department store? Department store. Boss, you said in a manger. He was born in Bethlehem. Boss, can you? <laughs> what are you talking about? Vern says, New York City's Macy. You got it, girl. Uh, Life of Bob says, Macy, Bozo, Hey, Gio, Vern's Mama Ray Ray. Marley's house, Mama. Uh, God is so good. I'm so excited to be getting free. Oh, I can't say what's wrong with your face products and possibly be paid for my reviews. It's definitely a praise report. That is a praise report. And they, they look, I mean, they checked out you and got you. LSP Macy's, Lewis Fuller Macy. Um, Moss is telling Calvin, hello. Uh, Mama Ray Ray Macy's. But, oh, you've been working overtime these Well, get that money. I don't blame you. Get that money. You got to pay all that child support. You better get that money in. It's Christmas time. Them babies need something. <laughs> I'm messing with you. Okay. Now, everybody should get this one also. We got nine people in the live and eight thumbs up. Come on now. Elvis isn't going to have a white Christmas. He's going to have a what Christmas? Bozo said, I have no kids. I know it. I'm just messing with you. Elvis isn't going to have a white Christmas. He, Y'all y'all better stop, Vern. She's on top of everything. Who else got it? Marley Blue. Life with Bob Blue, uh, Bozo, I'm Mr. Scrooge June, but I know you, Mr. Scrooge June. <laughs> okay, Kingdom Boy, I'm back. Okay, Bozo Blue, thank you, Bozo. Lewis Fuller Blue, Kingdom Boy, I'm a night driver, or oh, you be careful in the night. Mama Ray Ray, don't forget to smash that. That's right, Mama Ray Ray. Thank you. Pamela family, welcome to the live. How you doing? Your first time here? Everybody, all my mods, let's welcome Pamela family. Shenanigans. I can't. I know what I mean. We are so glad to have you here for the first time. Thank you for choosing to come to my live. We're doing Christmas cri uh, trivia questions. So come on and join in. I'm going to read the questions out and they're giving me the answers. Okay. So come on and have some fun with us. The boss says blue. Marley saying, hey, Pamela. Everybody's speaking to Pamela. Thank you all. That's right. That's how we show the love. But um, Elvis is having a blue Christmas, not a white Christmas. Okay, the next question. What do people traditionally put on top of a Christmas tree? What do people traditionally put on top of a Christmas tree? You're welcome, Pamela. We show love here and we have fun and we just chit chat and talk. It's all positive. We're just in here for one another to uplift. To, we pray for each other. We do testimonies about what we've been blessed, how the Lord has blessed us. But we're here to give God the glory, the honor and the praise and to have fun. So we're doing this now. Okay. Pamela says star. LSP says angel. We put a star up there. Pamela's right. But to traditionally, it's an angel. Vern has angel. Uh, Marley says star or angel. Yeah, because it could be both. It really could. So Pamela got it right also. Lewis says star. Marley, I use both. I do too. I do too. Uh, Bozo says welcome to the 2D screen starting June. <laughs> June book. Uh, the boss, star, bozo, star, 
uh, Marley, speaking to Bozo, they're getting ready to get in trouble. Uh, Bozo, a teddy bear. I've done that before too, Bozo. Uh, Pamela says she used both. I do too, Pamela. I use both sometimes. Okay, let's go to the next one. In Home Alone, where are the McAllisters going on vacation when they leave Kevin behind? In the movie, Home Alone, where are the McAllisters going on vacation when they leave Kevin behind? Or Bozo. They probably left Bozo behind too when they went on vacation. So where were they? Verse, you done read. You done done these questions. <laughs> Paris is it? Oh, you know it in the movie though. Uh, Marley says we need some air freshener. No, we don't. Y'all gonna quit that? Stop it! Stop it! <laughs> Bozo, lol. Uh, Life with Bob says Paris. Marley, France. Yeah, Paris. The boss, Vermont. Boss, are you still sleeping? <laughs> Louis Fuller, Paris, Bozo, LOL, Marley's. Yeah. Okay. Y'all did good on that one. Okay. We ready for the next one. In the classic, How the Grinch Stole Christmas, the Grinch was described, described with three words. What are those words? Uh, Louis Fuller says, please stop using Alexa. That's right. Thank you, Lewis. I know what they doing. The boss, LOL, LOL. I went to leave Junebug with all that tooting and let me not forget his sidekick, Marley. I know. No tooting today. We're going to act like adults. There she go again, y'all. Stink, stank, stunk. You hear that? Marley and Bozo, stink, stank, and stunk. In the classic How the Grinch Stole Christmas, the Grinch was described with three words. What are they? And that's what it is. Stink, stank, and stunk. That's for Marley and Bozo. Stink, stank, and stunk. Cheating with everybody saying, Burns, you cheating. <laughs> the boss, she said, Wow, really? Yes, that's the answer, boss. Burns, they say you cheating. <laughs> the boss, mean, mean, mean. <laughs> I know it. When I read that, that answer, the first thing came in my mind. Who was Bozo and Marley? <laughs> Stink, stank, and stunk. Burns, I'm at work. Okay, Burns. Okay, the next question. In which modern day country was St. Nicholas born? And which modern day country? Was St. Nicholas born? Y'all let Burns says Germany. No, no, not Germany. Marley says Rome, not Rome. Come on now, y'all. It's over there in that neighborhood, though. In which modern day country was St. Nicholas born? Marley says Rome. Pamela says England. No, not there. The boss, Canada. Start with a T. Start with a T. Life of Bob, uh, Bob says England. King. So 18 albums here in the midtime. I had New York where I live. We got some art. Good. Uh, Burns says Australia. Marley, UK. Starts with a T. Burns got it. Turkey. In which modern day country was St. Nicholas born? He was born in Turkey. Okay, the next one. Louis Fuller's in Turkey, Czechoslovakia. Okay, 
in the movie, It's a Wonderful Life. That's my one of my favorite movies. What happened every time a bell rung, rang in the movie, It's a Wonderful Life? What happened every time a bell rang? Both of those said Hawaii for that last one. There you go, Vern. Marley said it too. An angel got his wings. Oh, I love that movie. Life with Bob, an angel got their wings. Mama Ray Ray, an angel wings. That's right. Everybody watching that movie, aren't you? Pamela says he was in a new story. He was? Oh, okay. The boss, I don't remember. Have not seen it in a while. Yes, and every time uh, in the movie, It's a Wonderful Life, every time the bell rang, an angel got its wings. Uh, Kingdom Boy, you got merch too? Oh, it's a lot of merch here. Uh, Bozo, not yet. He talking to Gio. Okay, the next question. What words follow Silent Night in that song? Everybody should get this one. What words follow Silent Night in the song? Pamela said, LOL, I made that up. <laughs> okay, Kingdom Boy. Yay, you got it. Holy Night. That's right. Silent Night. Holy night, all is calm. Sing with me. All is bright round yon virgin mother and child. Holy infant so tender and mild. Sleep in heavenly peace. Sleep in heavenly peace. That's it. Bozo, holy night. Carter said, I'm here. Yes. And so you don't have to talk this time. You can keep your mouth shut. You talked too much this morning. Yeah, I'm getting on your butt. I told you to shut up. <laughs> you got to be still when the elders speak. You got to be still when the elders speak. You did good, though, Lisa. You did good. I enjoyed your live today. Uh, Carter seat, holy night, yes. Um, Carter's, well, look, who has the gift of a great voice? <laughs> no, I can't. Oh, Carter, sing. Sing, girl. <laughs> Mama Ray Ray, that's right. Uh, Burns, Carter's, eat. welcome to the live. Uh, Carter C says, set me right. I sure did. You set your butt down because you've been sick and ain't nothing to play with because we don't want you having no pneumonia or nothing. So really, uh, I'm serious. That comes from me because a couple of years ago I was sick back like you Carters. Hold on. I'm sorry. Y'all my grandson's calling. Hello. Huh? What? Yeah, I told Papa you were going to practice. You go, you going to wrestling practice? Okay, your daddy gonna pick you up. Okay, okay. Well, we all right then. Okay, be safe. Love you. Bye bye. Okay, uh, Lisa, I got real sick and I was like you. I had you know I, I didn't know if it was sinus or what, and I kept putting it off and putting it off, and. I kept running and doing what I had to do, which, like you. And my husband had went to a funeral, like in Crossville or something. And I got real sick and I had to go to the clinic. I couldn't put it off no longer. When I got to the clinic, I had pneumonia. I had pneumonia because I was fanning, acting like you. So be careful, Lisa, really be careful because you can easily, you know, as we get older, we get pneumonia. <laughs> I know you're still in your 40s, but as we get older, okay? Um, Lewis says, your voice and the angel. You're so sweet, but I can't sing, but I try. LOL, my favorite song is a Christmas song. You, Girl, I'm going to hurt you. I told you I didn't want to hear no more of the farting with you and Bozo, okay? I'm going to time you both out. No farting today. 
Uh, Kingdom Boy, he, he's talking about his band. I got a bed in our tour bus. Okay. That shame, Marley. I should have known. I know it. I know it. They can't help themselves. Bozo Marley needs uh, a cold, a Coleman cleaning. LOL, too much tooting. Boy. Hey, Betty White. Welcome to the live today. I'm glad you're here. What did grandma get run over by? What did grandma get ran, ran over by? A reindeer. Was it a reindeer? A reindeer. Uh -huh. Marley says, Betty, a reindeer. Uh-huh. Let's go to the next question, children. Which Hollywood actor played six different roles in the Polar Express? Which Hollywood actor played six different roles in the Polar Express? Come on now. I know y'all know the answer. Which Hollywood actor played six different roles in the Polar Express? Marley, Tom Hanks. That's it. Go ahead. Marley got it. Carter's Eat, Tom Hanks. Uh, Bozo said, speaking to Betty. Burns said, Tom Hanks. The boss, Eddie Murphy. <laughs> Boss, are you are you are you in there, uh, you know, drinking a little something? <laughs> oh, you cracking me up today, uh, Mama Ray Ray, Tom Hanks. That's right, Pamela, Tom Hanks. Life with Bob, Tom Hanks. <laughs> the boss, the boss said, "Okay, bring out the fam." Uh, boss, you done got me hot for the day. Okay. Uh, Bozo, Tom Hanks. The boss, really, you all Tom Hanks. <laughs> 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 oh, Jesus, help me. Boss, you really said Eddie Murphy? <laughs> okay, Carter, she stopped that egg knocking. <laughs> Oh, Jesus. Have mercy, Lord. He is the only one I know who can do multiple people. <laughs> Where Tom Hanks can. <laughs> Marley says, oh, boss, he was so good in those movies. <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh, Lord. <laughs> Bozo said, well, well, well. Oh, hey, everyone's smart. Welcome to the live. I'm glad you came in. At least you're helping me. Boss got me crying here. <laughs> oh, I didn't know Tom, but that about Tom Hanks. Mama Ray Ray said, Boss is okay. <laughs> Boss, you know I love you, though. That was good. Laughter is good for the soul. I needed that. Thank you, boss. Oh, Lord. Ooh, let me go to the next one. <laughs> I, can't, I got tears all in my eyes. I can't even see my right. Okay. Let me see. Okay. In Charles Dickinson's A Christmas Carol, what was the first name of Scrooge and Charles Dickinson's A Christmas Carol? What was the first name of Scrooge? <laughs> Pamela said, LOL, you kept me cracking. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, Lord. Oh, Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. Burn <laughs> <laughs> Ebenezer is in, yes. Boss, I'm going to tell Eddie I'm here. <laughs> okay. Oh, Lord. Marley, Ebenezer, Life with Bob, Ebenezer, God. Uh, 
And King Namor said, what is Charles Dickinson? <laughs> Oh, Jesus. Oh, it's going to be all right. It's going to be all right. He did Christmas stories, okay? Um, Edward Smart said, Ebenezer, Bozo, no, Mr. Screws, LOL. That's all me. It is all you. Oh, Bozo, you and Marley. Okay. Let's go. Okay. Which country did eggnog come from? Which country did eggnog come from? OMG, flower cracking up. And I am. I got tears all in my eye. The boss, I could have sworn I saw it. I quit for it. <laughs> I ain't going to be able to see no more. Don't do it. She said, I could have sworn. I saw Eddie Murphy in that movie. <laughs> Unless he turned white. <laughs> oh, Lord. Burns. And you know what? When you say something, Burn, I have to go look and check and make sure my words are right. No, you're wrong this time, Burn. <laughs> Life with Bob got it. England. Which country did eggnog come from? It's England. A burn says Germany. Bo uh, Bozo says, hey, Marley Boo. Um, Life with Bob says England. Kingdom Boy, don't know where in Midtown Manhattan, New York, where I live, maybe. No, baby. It was in England. It was in England. Uh, it was smart, said Germany. Uh, Boss says, well, 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 I am going to go out on a limb and say the USA. <laughs> you need to quit it. <laughs> Bozo said, LOL, Chio. Oh, Lord. Oh, whoo. Okay. Thank you. all Okay, let's go to the next one. Which real life person is Santa Claus based on? Okay. Now I know everybody in here don't know this one. Which real life person is Santa Claus based on? Santa Claus is based on a real life person. Who is it? And not your daddy. <laughs> oh. Kingdom Boy said, Where in Eng Where is England? Please don't make me laugh no more. Oh, Lord, Marley. Who came up with the idea of mistletoe? Is that the only way? Now, that's one of my questions. You need to hush. <laughs> Kingdom Boy, John Mayer, Kid Rock. I don't know who, what, you, what you're talking about there. The boss. <laughs> boss, what are you doing? <laughs> like... <laughs> Oh, Lord. Life with Bob says St. Nicholas. Pamela family says St. Nicholas. Okay, y'all right. Which real life person is Santa Claus based on? Santa Claus is based on the Christian Bishop St. Nicholas. The Christian Bishop St. Nicholas. Kingdom Boy says John Mayer or Kid Rock is Santa Claus. <laughs> no. <laughs> uh, the boss, Bill Cosby. <laughs> oh, Lord. Oh. Okay. What did Frosty the Snowman do when a magic hat was placed on his head? What did, oh gosh, what did Frosty the Snowman do when a magic hat was placed on his head? What did Frosty the Snowman do? Marley said, it just seems crazy people kissing on a, Marley, answer my question. And that's in my question. I can't ask that question now because you done bounced all around it. 
life. Kingdom boy, go get the hat. <laughs> go get the hat so you can see what I'm going to do. Um, the balls, he too, and it came on. <laughs> now you, oh gosh, you getting them other two fired up. <laughs> <laughs> Marley said, Bob. Okay. What did Frosty the Snowman do when a magic hat was placed on his head? What did he do? Anybody got an idea? Anybody got an idea? Now, Carter, if you're still in here, you and Bozo should do. No. Carter and Bozo does this all the time. So you should know. It was smart, said melted. No, that's not it. Kingdom boy said frosted the candy man. <laughs> no. Marley said with a toot here and a toot there. No. What did he do? It's something Bozo and Carter's eat do all the time. Thank you, LSP. He danced around. LSP put it first, dance, then boss danced. <laughs> He danced around when they put the magical hat on his head. Now, I thought you folks watch Christmas. <laughs> Y'all got tooting on your mind today. Okay. What is Ralphie's little brother's name in the movie A Christmas Story? Oh, LSP Drop. Be careful. Kingdom Boy said, I want candy nog. Okay. Get you some eggnog and put some a peppermint stick in there, and you got candy nog. What is Ralphie's? What is Ralphie's little brother's name in the movie A Christmas Story? Anybody got an idea? Burns says George. No. Uh, Marley said Tiny. No. Ball says Mike. Mikey. No. It starts with an R. It starts with an R. His name starts with an aura. I don't watch a Christmas story, so I have no idea what that is. <laughs> a Christmas story. Don't you remember seeing in the commercial? Do I have the right movie? Wait a minute, I may have the wrong movie. Where the little boy goes and sticks his uh, uh, mouth on that pole or something, and he gets stuck there. Am I in the right movie or the wrong movie? I don't know. Boss says Robert, LSP, Randy. That's it. His name was Randy. Uh, Ralphie's little brother's name in the movie, A Christmas Story, is Randy. Pamela says Ralph or Roger. <laughs> it was with an R. Okay. Now, y'all should get this one. What Christmas songs contains the lyrics, everyone dancing merrily and the new old fashioned way. Everyone dancing merrily and the new old fashioned way. What's the name of that song? Um, let's see, no, I didn't see that commercial, so I don't know what a Christmas. Okay, uh, Lewis Fuller, The Christmas Story is my favorite movie. See there, thank you, Lewis Kingdom Boy, rocking around the Christmas tree house. Okay, never heard you never heard of that, rocking around the Christmas tree in a new old fashioned way. Everyone singing merrily in the new old fashioned way. Who got that? Kingdom Boy got it. That's it. That is it. Rocking around the Christmas tree. Your life of boo. That's it. That's it. I can't believe you never heard that, boss. Wow, Paul said, never, never, never. <laughs> yes, that's the old one. Okay, 
Uh, what are you supposed to do when you find yourself under the mistletoe, Marley? What are you supposed to do when you find yourself under the mistletoe? Boss says, never enough. Oh, you dirty girl. You dirty, dirty girl. Lewis Fuller said, kiss. That's right. But you see what Boss says? It's not enough mistletoe. So she want to be kissing for days. Kingdom boy kiss. Love with <clears throat> life with Bob kiss. And and uh, the boss life said it's never enough there. <laughs> Marley kiss because they only kiss under it, it evidently. <laughs> you are a mess. Okay. Which country started to tradition of putting up a Christmas tree? Which country? Y'all should get this one because you don't put this word in most of the questions. Which country started the tradition <clears throat> of putting up a Christmas tree? And I didn't know that either. Not the U.S. Burns right. Germany. Germany started the tradition of putting up a Christmas tree. It was smart. Yeah, kids from the last one. Uh, Midtown Manhattan, New York, when I where I'm at. Not Midtown Manhattan. No, it was in Germany. It was in Germany, uh, Kingdom Boy. And the boss, the boss is, she wants the U.S. to be in everything. <laughs> But it wasn't us, boss. It was Germany. I was hoping it would, but it wouldn't. Okay. And what song, Winter Wonderland, won't... What did you call the snowman? I ain't going to say that because I don't know what I'm writing there. Okay. In the movie The Elf, what was the first root of code of the elves? In the movie, The Elf, now I know somebody, y'all got kids in here. In the movie, The Elf, what was the first rule of code of the elves? And it's something that we should do every day of our life. In the movie, Elf, what was the first rule of the code of the elves? Burn says not to be seen. No. Kingdom boy, elf, I hate that movie. <laughs> you hate that movie? Uh, Marley says smile. No, not smile. In the movie, elf, what was the first rule of code of the elves? Um, I'll give y'all that one. Treat every day like Christmas. Treat every day like Christmas. I like that. To treat every day like Christmas. Okay. What's the name? What's the name of the main vi uh, villain in the Nightmare Before Christmas? What is the name of the main villain in the Nightmare Before Christmas? Ball says, "Don't steal." It was smart prey. Yes, that's a good one there, Elwood. Uh, uh, treat everybody like Christmas. Yeah. <laughs> okay, boss. Uh, what's the what's what's the name of the main vil uh, villain in the Nightmare Before Christmas? I want to see who gets this. I put my skittles in my eggnog. I can see that. Yeah, I can see that. I like peppermint in mine, though. But Skittles, that's colorful and different tastes. Yeah. The boss says, Ed Edward Scissorhand. No, not Edward Scissorhand. I didn't know this one until I read it. Uh, a Night Before Christmas Scared Me. Oh, I'm sorry, Kingdom Boy. I am so sorry. I'll give y'all this one. Oogie, boogie. <laughs> it sounds like something Bozo would say. Oogie, boogie. Oogie, boogie. 
Okay. Whose eyes are all aglow in the Christmas song? Whose eyes are all aglow in the Christmas song? Whose eyes are all aglow in the Christmas song? Any ideas, Marley? The train carrying children to Christmas Town derailed in Mississippi last night. I'm not kidding you all. They had to get the kids off quickly. Well, I'm glad they got them off. Nobody was hurt or anything, were they? Oh, Ball said, really? How? I mean, she said, wow, yeah. That's a blessing. I'm glad they got them all off. The boss mind. Marley said, yes, I'm not sure about it. Okay. Boss said, Rudolph? No. The first name start with a T and the last name start with a T. I didn't know this one either. Whose eyes are all aglow in the Christmas song? It was smart, said uh, Rudolph. Tiny Tots. Who is Tiny Tots? That's the answer is Tiny Tots. But who is Tiny Tots? That one got me too. Life of Bob said children. Uh, Kingdom said Timmy Turner. <laughs> I don't last so much. I got a headache, y'all. I got a headache. Okay. What popular Christmas song was actually written for Thanksgiving? And I didn't know this. I was amazed. What popular Christmas song was actually written for Thanksgiving? Life of Bob said they are children. Oh, they're children. Tiny Tot, one of the elves. Okay, yeah, Tiny Tot, one of the elves. I didn't know that. Okay, Tiny Tots are children. Okay. Kingdom Boy, what? I don't listen to that crap. <laughs> what did you grow up with? Marley said on Christmas tree. Life with Bob over the river and through the woods to grandmother's house we go. No, y'all gonna be surprised what the answer is. It's really a Christmas song. It says, what popular Christmas song was actually written for Thanksgiving? And I would have never thought it starts with a J and the last word is a start with a B. And this song was actually written for Thanksgiving. Come on, y'all. I was trying to see if I see, because I had some on my Christmas tree, and I was, I guess it hadn't came around to that. I grew up with rock and pop music. Okay, Marley got it, Jingle Bells. Who would have ever thought that Jingle Bell was written for Thanksgiving? What popular Christmas song was actually written for Thanksgiving? And it was Jingle Bells. Life with Bob, Jingle Bells. Yeah, Jingle Bells. I'm, I would have never thought that was written for Thanksgiving. Angela, hey, Angela, we've been doing Christmas trivia questions. Jingle Bells, I wrote it three times and it vanished. Weird. Did you? Wow. And you knew that that was written for Thanksgiving? I didn't know that until I read it today. I did not know that that Jingle Bells was actually written for Thanksgiving. Kingdom Boy, I thought it was Jingle Bell Rock. Yeah, Jingle Bell. Wow. That's that's different. Because Jingle Bell, I, mean, I guess because we sung it so much for Christmas, I thought that was a Christmas song, but it was actually written for Thanksgiving. Okay. How many gifts in total were given the 12 days of Christmas song? How many gifts in total were given in the 12 days of Christmas song? How many gifts? 
Betty White says 13. No. Uh, it's more than that, Betty. Angela Critter, yeah, we sang it. But thank y'all did. Jingle bells. Wow. Angela says 12. No, it's more than that. LSP, I have to work on Monday. Not too happy, but it'll you got to work. Oh, I'm sorry. Kingdom Boy says 12 or 15. No. Ball says 12. It's way, way more than 12. Marley, 144. LOL. Nope. It's more than 144. Uh, Betty White says 24. Mm -mm. Carter Seat, I'm back. Okay. I'm glad you're back, Carter. Edward Smart says 12. No, it's more than 12. Um, how many gifts in total were given in the 12 days of Christmas song? How many gifts were given? LSP question. What's the question, LSP? Life with Bob says 78. No. Kingdom Boy, 200. It's more than 200. Um, Mari, 15. That's too many. That's too many. 1,500 is too many. How many gifts in total were given in the 12 days of Christmas songs? Vernon, all of the gifts cost $13. <laughs> I like that. Hey, Vernon, how you doing? Uh, Marley, 600. No, 600 is too many, Marley. How many gifts in total, we're given in the 12 days of Christmas song. The boss, 1,000. No, that's way too many, boss. And Marley had 600, and that's too many. Kingdom Boy, I don't know, figure, figs and pudding. <laughs> How many gifts in total were given in the 12 days of Christmas song? Boss says 25, it's way more than 25, but 400 is too much. Even if I'm wrong, can you say I'm right? If you're wrong, I'll say you're right. <laughs> no. no, I'll say you're right and then tell you you're wrong. Betty White says 76 is more than 76. How many gifts? Marty 360, you're getting close. Angela 325 is too many. 360 is too many, but you're in the neighborhood. Neighborhood Kingdom Boy, I don't know. Hey, General Matthew, how you doing? Welcome to the live. I'm glad you came in today. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Vern, Vernon said 78. Um, Vernon said I already knew. General Matthew, what we guessing? How many gifts? In total, were given in the 12 days of Christmas song. Marley says 350. No. Edward Smart, 74. Betty White, 82. Angela Critter, 280. My stream is frozen. Is it frozen, y'all? Thank you. Uh, Marley, 355. You're getting close. General Matthew, Kingdom. Yeah, I know you're a vegetarian. What happened? I don't know what happened, Vern. I don't. I don't know what happened. But we're not frozen. CJ forty-two, Marley three fifty-six is more than that, Marley. Um. Amelia Crow, don't put that in the live, please. Um. Mods, take that out. Betty White, 360. Uh, C Ray. Oh, I see we have some friends coming in. Uh, General Matthew, 364. That's the answer. 364. General Matthews got it first. 364. I want to tell everybody at, right after this live. Kicking It With Karen is going live at 4 p.m. Uh, don't forget tomorrow, Saturday, Team Bill, um, Geo will be on at 2 p.m. Please have your 20-hour playlist ready to go. Don't have any deleted or private videos in your uh, playlist because this week, 
I ran across so many deleted and private videos and, and playlists. So please do not have that in your playlist. Make sure it's correct when you come into the uh, live tomorrow at 2 p.m. on Team Bill with Geo. Um, make sure your about page is filled out. You have your IG account name in there and you have your email address. We are not uh, responding anymore in the comments. You're not responding anymore in the comments. So don't be sending uh, any comments. Let's pray and call it a week. That's what we're getting ready to do. I know. I'm going to speak, decree, and declare. And then, thank you, Lewis. Y'all just take care of them as they come out, come, come up. You know what to do with them. But I'm going to go ahead and speak, decree, and declare and pray. Let's, she's right. Let's pray. Father God, in the name of Jesus, I come into your presence with thanksgiving and praise. I come thankful all, for all those who have came into my life today, those who've come in here for good, and those who have come in here to start disturbing things. Lord, you know who they are. You know what they're all about. I pray, Lord, that you will um, prick their hearts and their minds. Most of all, Lord, I ask that you will save their soul, that you will give them a change of heart, that you, you will give them a new mission in life, not to be trolls, not to be trying to run from one life to another, trying to destroy and cause havoc in there. Lord, I pray that you would have mercy upon them and that you will save them. Lord, I thank you for everyone in the lives. I thank you for the testimonies, the good reports that we have received from different people. I thank you and I praise you and I ask that you continue to go with us, lead, guide, and direct us. Be with us as we're approaching the day that we celebrate your birthday, Lord. And I thank you for that day, which will be Wednesday. And I pray that everyone will have a blessed and glorious time that their heart's desire will be met. And Lord, the things that they need will be supplied. Lord, I thank you and I praise you. And for those who this is their first Christmas without their loved one, I ask that you will comfort them, that you will help them through that day, Lord, that you will give them the peace and the joy and the happiness that they need. Lord, I ask it all in Jesus' name. In Jesus' name, I pray. Amen. And thank you, Jesus. I'm going to speak, decree, and declare over your life right now. Uh, I am courageous. I am unstoppable. I am victorious. I am loved. I am blessed. I am gifted. I am anointed. I am successful. I am healed. I am healthy. I am beautiful. I am whole. I am confident. I am forgiving. I am grateful. I am generous. I am strong. I am favored. I am able. I am powerful. I am fruitful. I am God's masterpiece. You are God's masterpiece. Even the trolls are God's masterpiece because our God does not make any junk. And we thank you trolls who want to come and visit and think that what you're doing is destroying somebody. But I'm praying for your salvation, that you will be saved. You may be an atheist. I don't know what you are, but I pray that victory will come into your life. OK, remember, I love you, but God loves you more. Be blessed and prosperous and have a blessed week and go see Karen at Kicking It With Karen. She's going live at 4 p.m. I love you. Bye bye.